once again welcome to Agiotech. i'm so delighted to have you back on my channel remember to subscribe to the channel if you are new and also if you already subscribed then welcome back to my channel in today's tutorial i'm going to show you how to include slide master in your presentation this will save you a lot of time in preparing your presentation when you want to make changes this is going to make your work so easy for you so this is a very short presentation i have only up to four slides for now but you may have more slides and then you may want to make a lot of changes slide master will help you to do that so basically what is slide master slide master controls the look of your entire presentation including the fonts the background colors and then any other effects you want to include so this is my simple presentation i'm going to show you how to use the slide master to make some changes to the fonts the background colors and adding some images to this so let's see i want to i want the logo my logo to appear at the bottom of every slide over here how can i do that i can go to every slide and then be including that so i can use a slide master to do that so first of all i'm going to show my logo at the bottom right corner so let's go back to the top of my slide that's where i have what is python so we're going to include the slide master and then we can include the logo over there so um, to do that we go we do that we'll go to the view the view tab and then we'll go to what slide master even if you move your cursor to slide master, it tells you what the slide master does so you can see say must slide master controls the look of your entire presentation so that is what we're going to do so when you click on your slide master it gives you a lot of options above over here so you can see the first slide is your slide master anything we add to this slide will apply to the rest of our pages so i want to my logo to appear at the bottom right corner over here i want it on each of my slides so i'm going to do that in order to add that image i'll go to the insert tab and then go to what images so i'm going to select that image i think i have my logo down here so this is my logo i'll just double click on it and then this logo will appear over here. but i just move it down i'll move this down here just resize it and i have it on my bottom right corner okay so this is it we've added this to our slide master let's see if this will apply to the rest of our slide on our page in order to do that just go to your slide master and just close it and then you go back to your normal slide so you can see this is our normal slide we have initially you can see on every page we have the logo at the top of it so we don't have to do this on every individual page you can see the logo appears to be so big i want it smaller at the back at the right corner I can go back and do that and without slide master i have to do it on each and every page which would take a lot of time all i need to do is to go back to the slide master view slide master go back to the master page target my logo resize it and then drag it to the far bottom okay so when i close this and i go back it should be updated on every page as you can see we have a better logo and i still would need it to go a bit far to the right so this is things these are things you can do easily with the slide master that will save you a lot of time okay you don't need to do it on each and every page so make sure you are on the slide master page then you can assess every change whatever you are doing so i just want to move this thing here and that is it if i close it and i go back it has been updated on my pitch and within the slide master let's go back to our slide master within the slide master as well you should be able to add themes and other effects like i said it controls the entire presentation that's include the font background so if you want to change the entire background of my design or my presentation i can just go to background style and I select any background style of my choice okay so you can see we have different background style of my choice if i select this and i close this slide it's going to affect the rest of our pages you can see it has affected this if it's a team we want to use we can equally do that so if i go back and then i select go back to my slide master and i should go back my background and i change it to my default color okay so make sure you do it on the slide master these are individual slide and if you do it, it will not affect the rest so when you change it on this main slide it applies to all okay so this is our number one slide which is the main slide on our page i've changed this and if i want to use a different font you can see we have fonts over here and we can change to any font of our choice so you can see how this is going to look let me just go for a font that we can see how this is basically going to 
apply to our page. So I've selected font which will make everything appear to be very bold. So you can see our text over here is looking quite bigger. So now we have the Python and everything very bold. So this is a very unique way in which you can make changes to your slide with just some few clicks. You don't need to go from page to page and be doing those changes. Slide Master is going to save your time a lot. If it's about color, we have other colors and things you can use. If it's about the theme you want to use, you can click over here and select a theme of your choice from your Slide Master and this will affect the rest of your pages. So you can see if I close this and I go back to my presentation, this should be updated as well. Okay. And see our logo is still there. Our logo is still on the pages as you can see. So we can use Slide Master to make changes to everything we want to do on our page. So take note of this and then anytime you want to create any presentation, this is going to save you a lot of time. It will save you time a lot and using your image and doing some effects. So themes, layout, colors and every other things can be done using the Slide Master. So basically this is how to use the Slide Master to customize your page to change the entire look if it's about fonts just go to font and change it if it's about effects you want to add it's about team background and every other things you can do that within the slide master and once you close it your entire presentation will be updated accordingly so if i go ahead and add a new slide you can see this slide i've been created out of that template okay this slide i've been created and my logo and every other thing is appearing on this so if i go ahead and then add new more slide my logo will be updated and then it will keep moving like that so the master page basically is doing everything it's handling the looks the colors the font and everything for the rest of the pages and slide master is basically going to save your time a lot in doing modification changing the look of your entire presentation so if you look at my view as i said view slide master and then you can do all your changes over here but just make sure you're on your number one slide that is the main slide on the page and every other change you do over here is going to be applied to the rest of your pages thank you so much for watching this short tutorial so like come your way another time remember to subscribe to this channel and don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming tutorial i'm also having a series of tutorials in ph program if you're someone who want to learn programming become a seasoned web developer then remember to subscribe to this channel if you want to learn it tips and tricks also this channel belongs to you subscribe and join the evergreen community over here there's so many amazing things coming and if you enjoyed this tutorial, remember to like it as well thank you so much like come your way another time stay safe bye bye